yo what is going on guys we are back with another legends video and not gonna lie this video is going up later than i wanted to because i did have a little bit of a scare i did think that my mic was done working because my mic right it has like a green red sign it's green when it's uh like when i'm talking and then it's red when i push it to mute right so it was red it was like permanently red like i would click the unmute button and it'd still be red but all I had to do was disconnect it and connect it back so I thought I wasn't going to be able to make content from my uh, computer anymore and not going to lie for a video like this which is a lot to cover I, was, I wasn't I was trying to do it on my phone because on my phone I do use the InShot app and then the longer the video is the longer it takes to render and videos like these is not what you want to rate around to upload but anyways uh, I'm like hour late but it doesn't matter we're still gonna cover it because we do have a lot to go over so we're gonna start off with DKP who's actually a menace to society and also I do want to mention that I didn't expect this guy to come out this week and he's coming with the Super Saiyan Broly who will go after who will go over after and it's crazy because look at his color we literally just got a regen unit with the same color who you got for free but, I mean, I'd still grind up that Buhan if I was you. He still does buff purple anyway, so I guess you could bench him for DKP. But DKP is your go-to regen unit now. He is so good. And regen is now, I'd say, a top best three team in the game. They have every color. Every color of theirs is, is a beast. Green Majin Buu. Blue Kid Buu. Or Blue 21. You have uh, Red. Uh, actually, now you have Red Metal Cooler now uh the red zenkai metal cooler who and uh, there's really not much to go over i'm not gonna go over him he's he's decent all right i haven't seen him obviously in gameplay yet because he's not out yet but metal cooler is decent but he could be your new red unit if you don't have uh who's the red unit for oh if you don't have transforming cell or the zenkai cell then you have um who what is the next color i am so out of it oh yellow dkp and then you have purple dkp and then anyone for bun bench I guess you could bench 21 for that HP buff, because it is useful, I guess. But look at this. So you need Dragon Balls to transform, by the way. Um, it says it right here. Until one of these conditions is met, your main ability is sealed, which is what you transform with. Just like Bardock, you need somebody to die for him. But like for DKB, is different. But for Bardock, you need somebody to die, or you need to reach 50 counts in order to for your main ability to unlock and for you to transform. For DKP, you have to possess five or more Dragon Balls when entering the field. Oh wait, no, well, you just have to possess five or more Dragon Balls or you have to wait 30 timer counts. So just like, you know, like Bardock, I think is the only other unit with this, like lock on his main ability until he fulfills a certain condition and then he unlocks it so fast too. He, he himself, he also takes five timer counts. But while this character is on the battlefield, you, you reduce enemies' Dragon Balls by one when they switch activates once. Okay, well, it, it's not as broken. I thought it actually it was multiple times when I first read it, but just once. I mean, yeah, you can risk that, but more than once would have been hella broken anyway. Applies the following effects to self from battle until transformation. 45% of the damage inflicted reduces damage speed by 30. The following effects when this character enters the battlefield draw a special arts card, so that's a green card, and inflicts enemy will actually be downgraded plus 25 to damage received. So he's good in his base form, or his old form. Okay, uh, you get inflicts enemy with plus 10 damage received, so I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's every blast. Okay, that's crazy. Deals major damage, demonic barrage, uh, inflicts enemy with. Minus 60% to key. For 40 time accounts? Jeez, yo, you better hope your characters have some speedy key recovery. That's actually <clears throat> that's actually a pretty significant uh, debuff. Uh, his green card, which he draws, restores key by 30, cancels buff effects. Can it cancels enemy buff effects? What? There's no limit to that. Restores key by 30 and cancels enemy buff effects. But that's different from cancels enemy attribute upgrades. So I actually don't know what the difference is. But inflicts enemy with attribute downgrade plus three to sub count. Wow, bro. This guy is, I'm telling you, this guy is crazy. This, this guy is dumb. But uh, yeah, let's go, let's go to his transform form. I'm actually pretty, oh, by the way, we didn't even check out his stats. Let's put him at six stars. Let's see, 240k and 222k. So he's obviously a range type, yep. Okay, he, he looks pretty good. 
he DKP looks really damn good. But uh, let's see, King of the Demon Clan is his new is his main ability. Uh, so 20% of damage inflicted for 60 timer counts. Uh, minus five to strike. Wow, bro, this guy. And you need 10 timer counts. So the earliest you can get it. I mean, you could start off with four Dragon Balls. That's not impossible. So you could start off with four Dragon Balls and then get the fifth one. So I'd say by like 10 timer counts is the earliest. Depends on if you're the one who starts the combo. Because if you do start the combo with him, right? Then, you know, you do the four cards and you'll guarantee draw extra card. Uh, assuming that you're sidestepping or, uh, or charge stepping, right? So you'll get that fifth card. And if you get that Dragon Ball, you can transform immediately. So... You can get this main ability pretty quick, and this looks dumb. This looks dumb. This looks dumb. <laughs> like, I. DKP is a menace. Increase his own draw speed by level 1 for 15 timer counts when this character enters the battlefield. When this character enters the battlefield, applies pulling effects to enemies when they switch. Restores key by 20, but randomly draws a new uh, one card if you have 3 or fewer, and 20% of the damage inflicted. Hell on Earth, the following effects occurs after transforming, inflicts enemies with attribute downgrade plus 10 to damage received, 10% of the damage received from tag regeneration or PO or Dragon Ball Saga three times. 80% of the damage inflicted, reduces damage received by 30, and 60% to special move damage. Bro, what is this card? What is this guy? And he still has the same stuff. Uh, his new super is Demon Ray of Obliteration. I like that name. Uh, deals major ex uh, massive explode damage. Okay, that's really that's huge. A portion of the damage inflicted. Okay, yeah. So all your enemies take the hit. I mean, all your uh, cards take the hit. Restores key by 40. Randomly draws a new card. So basically, you restore 10 more key from the old one. Wow. Actually, no. The other one cancels buff effects instead of draws a new card. And then he buffs uh, Dragon Ball Saga regeneration and PO. So. Yeah, I, we already, some of us knew already because Goresh translated, it was already in the V-Jump. So that's Demon King Piccolo. Now, I'm not going to lie. He's the best unit here. He's going to be, he's better than Broly already. I've already read what Broly does, and Broly doesn't compare. So let's put Broly 6 stars. Max, he is a melee type. I don't know why he does. I wish he buffed Sans or Super Sans. So since I said that. He only buffs P.O., all right? That's all you got. That, that, that's so bad. Like, at least give him movies. At least give him uh, Saiyans. I wish he had Saiyans. I, I was going to um, record another video of the leaks, but I just waited until now because obviously I had to because of my mic. But I wish he was purple. If he was purple, I would have summoned for him. I didn't even care because I would have ran him with Bardock, right? But, nah. I'm just going to wait for Super Vegeta's Zenkai, bro. I'm not going to... I don't think I'm going to summon on this banner, but... Awaken Menace draws ultimate card gigantic explosion next. Restores key by 50, 20% of damage inflicted cannot be cancelled. He does have blast armor. 30% of damage inflicted against some families. That's actually really good, but he's yellow, so... Are you really going to be inflicting that much damage on Gohan? No. No, you're not. Absolutely not. Applies the following effects to self when this character enters the battlefield. 60% of the damage inflicted cannot be stacked. Reduces the damage received by 20 for 15. Gradually restores health each timer count and minus 5 to strike and blast. That's. I like that. 20% of the damage inflicted every time this character uses a strike. So he just. He gives me Kepler vibes, bro. He just gives me Kepler vibes. Gains uh, attribute upgrade minus 30% to sustain enemy damage cut when battle starts. Reduces the damage received by 30 until combo is over and knocks. Uh, so yeah, he has a strike cover change. Uh, blast strike. Yep. Uh, I like. Yep. Just like, like I said, Kepler vibes. Kepler does exactly that on her special move. Uh, battle sense. Uh, yeah, I do like this. I do like this green card. I wish she restored key, but it's all good. Uh, wait. No, 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 no. Go back up. Uh, major explode damage. Thirty percent of damage inflicted for the timer counts. A fortune of the yeah, yeah. So he also hits all your and uh, all your cards. Now, here's Boma. Boma. I'm not gonna read her whole kit. She's the, long story short, she's the 1,000 day unit. Uh, we'll just look at her 14 stars because I'm pretty sure that's what you get her at. Uh, pretty, pretty decent stats. Pretty, pretty decent. All right. That's what I'll give her. She's the 1,000 day unit again. Look, you even see her right here. DBL, thanks, 1,000. By the way, actually, no, we'll go over that towards when we uh, look at it. So basically what she does, she has something called 1,000 timer counts, which is 
infinite basically there's only 180 time accounts in a pvp match max you get is 200 when you're going against pve content for more support uh yeah i'm not gonna read her stats it doesn't really matter i really don't care she's just i mean she does she does good look cancels attribute and eyes for um uh, i don't know no, she cancels attribute downgrades all allies too uh five percent to damage inflicted for a thousand timer counts so she's basically just an infinite support unit and she also buffs hero and shallot uh, well i mean she buffs shallot and girls basically because shallot's basically the only hero you really run and yeah at least she buffs girls though but uh yeah that's boma now what we're gonna look at we're gonna look at the uh banner by the way uh metal cooler as i said i'm not really gonna go over him he's coming he's coming uh tonight and he's coming so lineage of evil in two weeks from now will probably become one of the best teams in the game again because ella frieza is 99.9999999% sure getting a zenkai and eloe is just gonna make a daring comeback but uh yeah here's the banner it brings back the tri troopers and the dogs i'm pretty sure all of them if not just bergamo Alright, yeah, so it's just Bergamo. We have a new EX Trunks who I don't care for, so I'm not going over him. He's already in game by the time uh, you're watching this, so you can uh, just go in your game and read what he does if you scroll to the bottom. So, pretty okay banner. The Pride Troopers is a big win. It's not all that. But, uh, yeah. Uh, that's pretty much it. Um... Let's look at what is coming, which is the Ultra Space Time. By the way, the uh, the Just Surpass Me event is coming back too. This comes tonight, and by the way, speaking of the banner, I actually forgot to mention. The banners drop on Saturday, basically, and five days from now, the 28th. So, yeah, they're not dropping tonight, just like the Yamchen thing. But this gives you so many of these coins. I don't know if they're gonna make it like hard. I think I think that this is gonna be a pretty tough event because look at the rewards. Like looking at this, I don't know how much the Zen. By the way, uh, I didn't even mention it either. But you're gonna be able to Zenkai the permanent Zenkai banners for free. I'm pretty sure. Like you'll maybe not full Zenkai, but you'll be able to Zenkai them for sure. But uh, yeah. It it's really and yeah pretty much it uh that's pretty much it for this update there's a new equip Majin Buu don't really care but uh yeah I'm just trying to get this video out but uh yeah this should be coming out in a couple of hours the only thing that's not coming tonight actually there's a lot of things not coming tonight the banner's not coming tonight the just surpass me event is not coming tonight basically the only thing that's coming is the ultra space time rush but uh yeah this brings us to the end of the video, man. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, all those things. And I'll see you guys in the next one.